Hello, ladies and promosexuals. Let's get ready to rumble. Yeah, uh, that was gay. Not homosexual, just gay as in the you know general term for negative actions. Uh, I love gay people. Not gay as in negative, gay as in homosexual. But I'm not gay, as in homosexual. But I am gay, as in negative. So, uh, how you guys doing? Welcome to another Pokemon shoutout. What's your old pal Garo TD23? Uh, I want to give another shout out to uh, Grezla Joe, or how, I don't know how to say your name, man. But uh, if you're watching this, thank you again for uh, giving me this here team right here. Giving me this here team right here because it is fun as fuck and I love it. It's just like, I'm gonna wreck it and then uh, that's what it does. And it and it wrecks it and I'm like, ah, it, like, it wrecked stuff. Uh, so Brett's on his side. I actually love his team because it's not all OU stuff. It's uh, It has an offensive Blastoise which makes my pants wet uh, just thinking about it. I uh, didn't do very much but still just a thought because Blastoise was my favorite starter out of the three. Um, I, it was always hard picking one, but I always loved Blastoise because he had freaking cannons on his back. He, he was ready to do work. All he needed was his hard hat. And uh, so, yeah. Um, uh, I don't really know. I mean, I'm just really confident with this team because he made it very, very well. Uh, it, it's made to just like punch stuff in the face really hard and kill it in one hit. So, so there's no like setting up. Oh, well, um, actually the uh, Infernape and the uh, Conkeldur set up, but they they do a very roundabout job of it. Like uh, Infernape has the focus sash, so he comes in uh, whenever it's safe, can take a hit, get a get a freaking uh, what you call it, Swords Dance. He has Iron Fist and stab and then also the mock punch show priority and it just kind of like BAM in the face and you're gone son you're gone so uh, let's go ahead and get into that game right now actually Ta -da! I'm gonna lead off with my Santa Esmeralda as he leads off with his Infernape and I'm like well I have you know Esmeralda's a pretty good counter to his whole team actually because uh, the coverage is amazing so uh, he's gonna go for the uh, he has a focus ash I, you know going for the earthquake just to get damage off I guess and the mock punch I, res I quad resist that so I can obviously live it. Uh, here, I know he's gonna go for something flying, and I'm like, the only thing I really, uh, actually I didn't know. I figured, you know, he might use the sky, not sky attack, sucker punch. But he goes for the sky attack now, and takes out my Goldberg, who is gonna be renamed to Ralph, uh, in honor of Record Ralph. So now I'm bringing Esmeralda, who is Scarf, and I know Thunder Punch is gonna take it out because Honkrow, does not have the best of defenses, and Esmeralda has that uh, power booster, whatever the hell that shit is. So uh, Alakazam comes in, and I'm like, you are also a glass cannon, but he's also scarfed. So, but I get the paralyze, which is awesome. It doesn't really come into play here. I just kind of let Esmeralda die now to the uh, shadow ball, the obvious shadow ball. Uh, because uh, I don't know why, I just felt like that was a good play to do. Uh, then uh, Domino, the Death Suit's gonna come in and back punch, get that thing out because it's safe switch in. Um, and now he can bring in his Blastoise, but because I have my Sash, I get a free Swords Dance. I will be a Shedinja with one HP, but I'm also like, you know, 10 times more powerful with these goddamn Iron Fists. So uh, get the Swords Dance. He goes for the Water Spout and I almost creamed my pants. I was like, uh. You're not defensive. I love you. Uh, sorry, it's just so weird and I love it. Weird stuff gets me off if you didn't know. So I go for the close combat taken out. Lucario comes in and I'm like, Mock Punch! Because you have extreme speed. He's also Sash. So I'm like, dude, how many Sashes do you got, bro? Those for the Aura Sphere, of course, is going to take me out. I've only got one HP. Uh, which is fine because um, I have another Mock Puncher in Eldora my Conkeldur, uh, she's gonna go for her mock punch, take out the uh, Lucario, and she's pretty bulky, so I'm not too worried about the Haxorus, uh, so he's gonna bring in the Haxorus, outspeed me, go for the Outrage, take me out by 65, he's got the Life Orb, so I'm like, you're definitely gonna die now, because I've got Ice Punch, and uh, 
max attack adamant you're 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 gone sir you're gone there's nothing you can do about that i'm just saying so uh that's gg right there sorry it was so quick uh but it had to be done it had to be done love this team thank you again uh grizzla joe i think that's how you say your name and uh make sure you rate comment and subscribe because if you don't you don't get cookies and if you leave a like you'll get twice the cookies because i know you enjoyed it uh Woo. I don't really know. What's your guys' favorite color? I haven't asked you guys that. Um, I'm really, my, my, I'm, I don't, okay. Birthday is December 31st, 1990. So I'm 22, almost 23. My birthstone is the uh, Bliss Zirconium. And that is my favorite color. And that is exactly why, because it is pretty as shit. You know, like your boy, like me, pretty as shit. Pretty boy Shawn Michaels. Um, yeah, blue zirconium. What is you guys' favorite color? Make sure you leave a like because I know you enjoyed it, guys. Come on, leave me a like. I need to get at least 20 likes or ain't nobody getting no cookies. At least 20. Come on, guys, help me out and subscribe and I'll give you some more. I'll air mail you out some fresh fucking cookies. Get, get at your boy. I'll see you guys later. Bye.